Hey guys, you'll never guess who it is. Uh, okay, so it's, uh, it's, it's like 1 in the morning. I'm recording this vlog right now, uh, but I'm not going to be uploading it until after the Life is Strange video comes out. Uh, so, if, if you're watching this, I hope you enjoyed that video. Uh, I spent uh, way too long uh, working on it, and I partially wanted to talk on, about why that took so long, and about some changes going forward. So as you probably guessed, uh, I'm, I'm an adult with a job, uh, though I may not look it. So all the YouTube stuff is just stuff that I do on the side, but I'm not like doing my day job. And then on top of that, you know, like I'm pursuing film. So I'm mean, trying to like do that, and then so that that also goes above YouTube, but generally on priorities, like below the day job, because I, I gotta eat. And you know, for, for a couple years now, I've had a, a, a job in a restaurant that was, uh, pretty good in terms of, you know, uh, giving me the financial security to be pursuing things. And, uh, and, and it was great. I worked with a lot of people who were insanely supportive, and uh, I, I do feel I grew a lot as a person. I was able to direct a short film uh, while I was there, and, and you know, I, there was a lot of growth, especially in like that first uh, like year and a half of me being there. But then recently, like the last couple months especially, uh, I, I just felt like it was kind of consuming my life, uh, and, and it got to the point where I, I was feeling drained, and it was, it was difficult to uh, c come back from work and, and want to still work on things. I felt like I had no energy left to be creative, which was awful, because that making things is one of the only things that uh, makes me feel good about myself. So I just, in general, was being very unhappy and feeling stuck and feeling like I wasn't growing. Uh, so the last few months, uh, I've really started pushing myself as an editor and picking up uh, little like short films, started editing and coloring short films and, and stuff like that. And, and I recently did a fairly big project, it wasn't, it wasn't a film, but it was, it was a big editing project that paid enough money that I have put away enough to feel comfortable uh, quitting my day job and going into film full time. Uh, today was actually my last day. Uh, I, uh, I just got back from kind of celebrating with uh, a lot of my co-workers. And it's a weird feeling. Uh, you know, I've, I've always worked for like an hourly wage to pay my bills and then had to do the stuff that I wanted to do with my life like on the side. And so uh, the idea that now I'm going to be in charge of my own schedule is a really strange concept to try and wrap my head around, I guess. And, uh, you know, hopefully it'll go well and I'll pick up enough work to be able to just keep supporting myself this way and be able to go on any audition I want and be able to write and create and just be making things uh, and being compensated for it, mostly through editing, because it's... Let me say, pro tip, it's easier to get paid to edit uh, than to do pretty much anything else in film, uh, because nobody expects you to edit for exposure. And so, you know, I've been editing, like, my YouTube videos and stuff like that for, for years, but I never really considered myself, like, a professional editor. Uh, but I built a computer a little under a year ago uh, that could actually handle, like, serious editing. And uh, I just started challenging myself to pick up projects that I was worried I, I, I wasn't, like, competent enough for, or... Uh, that I wasn't ready for, and I just kind of challenged myself to to handle it anyways. And so I've grown a lot as an editor, and, and I feel like I can actually kind of hold my own in that field now. So what does that mean for this channel? Uh, what that means for this channel is now I will have a lot more time uh, to be making this. Um, like, I, I'm just going to be finishing Life is Strange over the next couple days. That is, like, my goal is to just get it done within the first week because it has been sitting at like 60% completion for a long time. A lot of it because of scheduling and just how hard it is to, to meet up to shoot things with people with the schedule and everything, but now it's, it's going to be open. And I feel like even through the Life is Strange process, I've learned a lot about editing. And uh, so I, I'm, I'm excited to just kind of amp up what I'm going to be doing on YouTube. I want to come at it harder than I have in a long time. Uh, and I'm going to be revamping my Patreon as well, because if I'm going to be uh, creating for a living, that, that is one avenue that I feel I, I should be pursuing. If you don't know, I opened up a Patreon, like, a, a long time ago, and I, and I didn't really 
go at it too hard. Uh, mostly because, you know, like, YouTube wasn't a serious thing for me. And it's still not going to be, like, my, my main method of income or whatever, but uh, I will be putting more time into it than I've been able to in the last year and a half, about. And so with that in mind, uh, I, I kind of want to ask you guys what sort of content you want to see from me. What sort of videos uh, that I've made, because I've made, I've made like kind of a wide variety. If you compare like the Undertale video to like the Pandora's Tower video, you compare that to the Last Story video, you compare that to like the Evil End video, they're all like very different kinds of things. Uh, and so I just kind of want to know, like, what kind of stuff resonated with you guys? What, what sort of things do you want to see more of from me? Do you want to see something with a more comedic bent, something with a... With a, with a more analytical bent, do you, do you want old games, new games? I, I may not listen entirely to it, because ultimately it's got to be a video I want to make or I'm not going to make it. But uh, I, I, I am curious to see what kind of things you want me to do. Should I, should I do Q&A stuff? Should I do more live action stuff? Part of me kind of feels uh, bad for posting a lot of videos that are just me talking to a camera, because I feel like they're very low effort compared to, you know, like, like big editing projects. But if... If, if it wouldn't bother you guys to have the channel have more of those, I, I could I, I, I could do more of that. Anyway, just let me know that stuff below. And other things, if you know uh, one of my best friends, uh, Pizza Dude Man Guy, he, he does a lot of Let's Plays. I did one with him while I was back home for Christmas. Uh, we played through Pikmin, and that whole thing is now up on his channel. And it's, it's, it's pretty funny. I, th I think there's a couple episodes especially that are, uh, th that are really great. I got really tired. Uh, while playing it because uh, we, we had one night to record this and so we recorded from like 8 o'clock uh, Christmas Eve until 5 in the morning on Christmas Day and by the end oh, I was exhausted <laughs> much like right now uh, I opened today for my last day so I've been up for almost 24 hours now. Other than that, over the next couple weeks, I'm really going to be working on putting together uh, some reels to showcase my editing work, my color correction work, uh, honestly, some new acting reels, because I, I need to put some more of those together as well. Uh, I'm going to be building like a new website that actually showcases everything I do instead of just the acting stuff. And uh, I've also been kind of silent uh, because the last couple months have seen uh, the, the release of a lot of games I've been waiting for for a long time and I've been really excited about. We had The Last Guardian and Final Fantasy XV and the Zelda Breath of the Wild. And the thing is, like, while I've really been wanting to stream more, uh, those games were kind of games that I wanted to just sort of have for myself. You know, they, they were things that I didn't want to, to, to play with, like, the, the pressure of having an audience there. So I, I'm sorry about that, but I do want to be streaming more regularly. Uh, especially, you know, now that I can make my own schedule. Uh, I, I want to actually just get like a set routine, streaming like a couple nights a week, uh, doing you know, just random stuff. We can do like a, uh, like a day of Overwatch because I know a lot of people like Overwatch, and I've been playing it. Uh, I, I got I got a little hooked. I'm playing a little Final Fantasy XIV, so we can do those hangout streams. They'll be pretty chill. Uh, those are pretty laid back, so those would be like Q and A streams sort of thing, just kind of laid back, like talking sort of thing. And then you know uh, I've, I've got. I've got over a thousand games. I've got over a thousand games in my Steam library, and there, there's a lot I need to play. So I could just do, maybe I'll do three days, and I'll do, like, Overwatch and Final Fantasy, and then, like, a, a, a day where we just play random Steam games and just see what's good out of, out of all the crap I've pulled out of bundles over the last couple of years. But I don't know, I'm, I'm still thinking about that, but I really want to hit Twitch and YouTube hard. I also recently had, like, a small part in a feature film. I have some more film projects that are, like, underway that I can't say a lot about right now, but should be able to say things soon. Uh, I, I did like a, like a, like a skit, like a, like a little, little parody commercial thing over on my main filmmaking channel. Don't know why I'm pointing over there. It's not going to be there. So you want to check that out. That's, that, that's over on my filmmaking channel, which is just my name. Uh, speaking of which, I really got to rebrand this channel. I, I just do not like the name Lord Jackal. It just sounds like a 10 year old trying to be cool. I, I gotta think of something different. And really, I, I just want to thank you guys for uh, still watching this and kind of like sticking with me enough to actually look at this video uh, with how inactive I've been. This is a huge transition period in my life, and so I, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of terrified, but, but also I'm just I'm, I'm very excited to try to be creating for a living. And uh, it's. It's a big rush, and uh, I hope you guys will stick around to see what happens.
Alright, thanks for watching, guys. I don't know if this is coherent, but I gotta go to sleep. If this is really bad, and I didn't even say the things I was supposed to say, then I guess I'll reshoot it later. I don't know. What do you think, Sally? What do you think? Sally's not even... She doesn't give a shit. She doesn't even care. Whatever. You don't even care, do you? You want me to get this thing out of your face, don't you?